Breaking right now at 10, police are searching for the man accused of shooting a person in OTR. Thanks for joining us at 10. I'm Trisha Mackey. And I'm Rob Williams. Chancellor Wynn joins us live from Vine Street with the very latest. Yes, so we are live right now on Vine Street. In fact, we're at the corner of Vine and Liberty Street. I want you to take a look behind me because this is where that shooting scene was. It's actually on the same side of the street, to so the left side of your screen, the St. Francis Serif Church. It's on that side, about a block north of Liberty Street. And we know, according to the Cincinnati police, that this shooting happened around 725. We actually have a bit of video from the scene as officers were out here investigating. Now, they are, again, searching for that suspected shooter. And according to Cincinnati police, they believe the suspected shooter is a black man in his late 40s, about five foot six inches tall, possibly wearing a white t-shirt with black pants, short dreadlocks, and a fanny pack. Now again, police are still searching for this suspected shooter, and they believe that this shooting could have possibly happened from an argument because we know the victim, the victim, according to police, is a male black in his late 40s as well. He was shot in the hip area and was taken to the University of Cincinnati Medical Center. Now, police do say that he received non-life-threatening injuries, so while he is at the hospital, he is expected to survive. Now, where things get a little bit interesting, according to Cincinnati police, there were quite a few people on scene he here again near St. Francis Seraph Church, but officers say they were not receiving a lot of cooperation from the people who were on scene in this area. But with them telling us that they believe this stems from a possible argument between the suspected shooter and the victim in this case, they are again searching for that suspect. The suspected shooter, who they believe is around five foot six inches tall, he's a male, a black man in his late 40s with again short dreads, a white t shirt, black pants, and again that fanny pack. So if you have any information about this shooting or possibly information about the whereabouts of this suspected shooter, simply contact Cincinnati police. But again, they are very early on in this investigation because that shooting happened around 725. So while the crime scene is clear now, officers were here on scene collecting evidence, but they did say they did not recover any shell casings, but they are collecting evidence and looking again for that suspected shooter. But for now, reporting live and over the Rhine, Chancellor Wynn, Fox 19 Now. Chance, thank you very much. As I was